Hey everyone, it's Nicole and welcome back to my channel and it is March 2nd. I'm not quite sure when this video will go up, but I have officially finished my $80 a month for food challenge. If you have not seen part one of this video, go ahead and um, I will link that down below. Go ahead and click on that and watch that before you watch this. Um, so basically, I wanted to spend 80 bucks for the entire month of February with food um, so I can clean out my pantry and also save a ton of money. Um, I will link my money saving tip video below as well so you guys can check that out too. And I guess let's just go ahead and get right into it and I'll show you guys how I did. Okay, so in short, overall, I actually did really, really well. Um, I really wanted to succeed at this. I really wanted to try very, very hard to stay under the $80, hence why I actually put it online so I could hold myself accountable. And I did everything that I could. We didn't go out to eat the entire month, which is the main thing. Um, and that was probably the hardest of it all, especially with us working such crazy hours. I mean, there would be days where I would work 13, 14 hours straight. And it was really, really hard to pass up all of the restaurants on the way home from work because it's just so easy to stop and grab something. Um, but it did help knowing that either one, I had leftovers or two, like I knew exactly what I had in the house. That way I was able to make something really quick. And if I knew that I was going to be working really, really long hours, I would typically have something already made that way I could heat it up or have something in mind like that would be a ramen noodle night or a cereal night, something like that. Um, so I tried to plan that out a little bit ahead of time. So we did really, really well in that area. Uh, my pantry is like completely empty now, which is absolutely amazing. I went through so much stuff. I still have some soup left, some pasta left, things like that. But for the most part, I probably cleared out about, I would say about half of my pantry is completely gone. So that was amazing as well. However, I did fail. Um, but I had a good reason, and I'll show you that reason. Girl Scout cookies. Okay, so it's just hard to resist, and those cute little girls are just uh, so freaking cute. So I ended up buying a couple boxes of Girl Scout cookies, which actually put me over my $80 budget, but I wasn't even upset. Like, how can you be upset about Girl Scout cookies? So... That was the only reason that I had failed this entire thing, but again, not even mad about it because I love me some Girl Scout cookies, so I went ahead and picked up a few boxes of those. So it actually put me over budget by like $10, so all in all, still a really, really good month, even though technically I failed, but I'll take it. Okay, so just as a recap, yes, technically I did fail, however... I still think that I did really, really good overall. My pantry is super empty. My fridge is empty. My freezer is empty. So that's great. Um, going forward, starting in March anyway, I am going to bump that number up just a little bit for two reasons. One, there's only 28 days in February. There's 31 in March, so I have to count for an extra three days. And then also, since I did use so much from my pantry, I will have to buy more. Actually, three reasons, I guess. The third reason was I do want to eat a little bit healthier than what I was eating. Um, I know a few people commented that it wasn't the healthiest, you know, diet, I guess. But I really wanted to get all of that extra crap out of my pantry. So um, I did really good doing that. So now moving forward, I will be able to eat healthier things like salads and things like that, which still can be super cheap. The protein basically is the most expensive part of a salad, so there will be a few nights probably this month where I would just eat a salad with no chicken in it, which is absolutely fine. It's still super healthy, and it still fills me up. So overall, I still think that I did really, really good, and I challenge you guys to do this video too because it is really, really fun for one, to go through and see what you have, and two, it's also just a great way to save money. Um, so if you are like me, trying to get out of debt, slash buy a house, slash do a thousand other things with your life, this is just a really good, and it's going to like clean things out um, and stay organized in your kitchen and things like that too. So if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe because I will be doing more types of these videos in the future, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!